This is a, a Sterling engine, uh, probably built in the from the looks from the construction of it. Looks like it was built in the late uh, or early 1900s. I bought it from a fellow in uh, Rio Dosa who thought it was a steam engine. It is in fact a Sterling engine. Uh, let me give her a start here. It, uh, the Sterling engine was invented by Sir Robert Sterling in the late uh, 18th century. Uh, it has not been used very much for commercial purposes because there's little torque, very little torque. Uh, I've heard that it was used in dentist offices to um, pump water and to uh, um, perhaps uh, provide air pressure. Uh, because it was a very quiet running engine and it could be uh, uh, run off of uh, charcoal or, or small alcohol flame. Uh, this portion right here inside this is where the flame is. In this case I've got a butane flame going against a cylinder which has a piston in it which does not touch the side walls of the cylinder. This right here is a water jacket. This is a water container. Uh, water flows uh, through. Looks like my flame went out when I tipped it over. Uh, water goes through this and, and cools it. This is the power piston. These two pistons are linked together but not to the outside atmosphere. Even though it was built many, many, many years ago, it is still, uh, as you can see, runs very good. And that is my purchased Sterling engine.